Hi guys, so I recently got some new products from Cargo Cosmetics. I don't need to tell you what they are, I'm just going to show you what they are. So one of the first things that I saw when I opened the package was this new eyeshadow palette called Chill on the Six. Now if you don't know why it's called Chill on the Six by the packaging, it looks like it's a wintry themed palette and when you open the palette inside you see beautiful I would say they're cool tones these are a quad of purples a quad of blue grays and a quad of I would say cool browns so these are perfect for winter and if you want a cool toned look um, my thoughts of this shadow palette originally I wasn't a big fan of cargo cosmetics shadow palettes but recently I've become a fan the down under palette was beautiful um, they applied really well. They're not necessarily creamy shadows, but they are very pigmented. So I really do like them. And this one is so fun. It has one, two, three, four. I would say it has like four or five super sparkly colors. And then five mattes. And then one or two, they're just semi-sparkly. So definitely a fun palette. And I think it's going to be perfect for winter evenings out but as you can I'm wearing it today I'm wearing the purple quad today on my eyes so this one I'm liking the next thing that I had a chance to try was the new cargo HD liquid foundation and it says it's formulated for high definition filming this lightweight oil free foundation Blends beautifully to provide medium to full coverage and a natural, picture-perfect look. Contains light diffusing pigments for an optical blurring effect, reducing the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. So, let me just open this. You get one fluid ounce. So as far as foundation bottles go, I'd say it's mid-size. It's not big. It's not small. It's somewhere in the middle. And it squeezes out, which is nice. Um, I applied this today with my Beauty Blender, and it took about four coats to cover my skin, my blemishes, to not look patchy, so that's a lot. I ended up squeezing a lot of product out. So next time, I think I'm going to try to apply it with a Kabuki brush and see if that makes a difference. But using the Beauty Blender, I found that I used too much product, so... This is probably not a product I'm going to be using every day just because it requires a lot, but I did like the final effect once it was all applied and buffed in. So when they say medium to full coverage, I would probably say it's closer to the medium side. The next product that I had a chance to try, which I've been seeing all over Instagram, are Cargo Swimmables Eyeliner Pencils. They look like this. They've got fun metallic caps. They're just gel eyeliner pencils. There's nothing fancy about them, but they're swimmable, so they should be water resistant. So next time I go swimming, I will definitely be trying it. Uh, let's see what it says. It says, the creamy waterproof and smudge proof formula glides on with ease and won't budge for up to 14 hours. All right, so take a line from Jeffree Star Cargo. I see you. The next product that I've used, which I think is one of their spring products, it's not one of their newer ones, is the Cargo Cosmetics Boundless Lashes Mascara. I love this mascara. It's probably in my top five, which I think I said last time I did a video with this one. The bristles are spread out, but they're all different lengths. So it's perfect for getting every lash, the short ones, the long ones, and getting in between them. So I'll zoom in on my lashes so you can see. So big fan of this one as well. The next product that I used or tried out was the Cargo Cosmetics Gel Lip Color. And this says, this ultra lightweight gel lip color delivers buildable coverage that feels comfortable and is never drying. Once applied, the hydrating formula helps to moisturize and protect lips. 
So today I used the color Bora Bora, which is like a, I, I don't know, a petal pink. So it comes in a lipstick tube and I have one coat of it on my lips. So let's see if this is buildable. Yep. It's very moist. It doesn't have any weird effect. Um, it doesn't have any weird tastes like some other brands do. That's one of my pet peeves. If something's on my lips and it has a chemically taste or a strange fragrance when I breathe in, I just can't wear it. Some of the drugstore cosmetic lip products have that and I can't do it. Sorry guys, I can't do it. If it's peppermint, however, I do love lip products that are peppermint flavor. This one is not, but this does not have a taste or fragrance at all. So. I like this. I like that it's moisturizing. The color is really pretty and it is definitely buildable. The box didn't stay how long it would last so stay tuned for an update on this as this is only first impressions. I also received the color Barbados which is a really pretty peach color. So we're heading into fall. I think I can get away with the peach one in fall but not so sure about this bright pink but I tend to wear all colors all year long. So. I'll make it work. Another, well that's a Tim Gunn phrase, make it work. And the final product that I used today, which is not a new one, is the Cargo Cosmetics Brow How Brow Defining Kit. When I have time, I like to use this one. Um, normally I just use a brow pencil, draw it on, and go. But for days when I have a little bit more time, I like this because it gives you kind of like the gel pomade and then the powder to set it and also to kind of fill in extra spaces. And it comes with a little brush which is the perfect size for kind of drawing on your eyebrows which I usually have to do every day or I don't feel complete. So I like this product. I actually don't have anything bad to say about these products aside from the fact that with the foundation it requires a lot of coats to fully cover your skin and get that full coverage look. But aside from that, I'm I'm really enjoying the products that Cargo has been coming out with lately and I can't wait to see what they come out with next. So I hope you enjoyed this first impressions video and stay tuned for some tutorial videos using these products in the future. Have a great weekend everyone. Bye bye.